Hey, if you're wondering if it is possible to get the Google Play Store to your Fire Stick, then I got both bad and good news for you. The bad news is you cannot get the exact copy of Google Play Store to your Fire Stick. But the good news is that you can actually get an amazing alternative, which is called APK Time. That's an alternative app store for your Fire Stick, which has thousands of apps which are not available in the official Amazon App Store by default. There are loads of different categories such as tools, sports, torrents, players and browsers, music, live, gaming, free VPNs, essentials, entertainment, APK seekers, animations, top APKs, and so on. And actually, it's super easy to set up APK time to your device. So now, without any further ado, let me show you how to get that amazing alternative for Google Play Store to your device. First of all, as always, you'll have to get an app code and loader to your Fire Stick. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, we go to search on your device and start typing the loader in the search bar. And now, as you can see, the loader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So there was even no need to enter whole name of the app. We click on the loader and that's the app which you need to get to your device. But after you got the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. So in order to set up the loader, we gotta go to settings. So click on the home button on your remote. And then we need to click on that button with the gear icon. After that, we scroll down until we find my Fire TV. Click on it. And here we'll have to enable developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Sticks, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's actually easy to make them appear. We just need to go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you'll have to click on the middle button on your remote for seven times. And do it fast, so let's do it. And as you can see, now the button for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if we go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. From here, we need to locate the loader, here it is, and turn that option on. So basically what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device, which is right here. We open it, and here you'll find the loader, which is a tab and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which you always recommend doing. It's, of course, connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, we just connect to any server. So let's say I will connect to Singapore right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So we gotta go to the list of apps and now we open the loader, here it is. There, on the left side menu, make sure to click on home and not on browser. So once again, make sure that you have clicked on home 
And then in that search bar, we'll need to enter a code, which is going to be 2, 8, 9, 0, and 7. So once again, the code is 2, 8, 9, 0, 7. Make sure to enter it exactly as you see, and do not make any mistakes. Because obviously, if you make a mistake, then the link is not going to work. And then we'll have to click on go, and while the website is loading, make sure to subscribe my channel, so you will get even more content about forestics as well as please hit the like button below this video. It truly really helps me a lot, and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now, after the website has opened, we just have to scroll it down a little bit until we see that list of categories. And from the list, we'll have to click on App Stores, which is right here, so that's the button with App Stores. Let's click on it. And then a huge list of apps is going to open up for you, and from here we have to click on APK time, which is right here. So we click on APK time, then an ad might pop up for you. If it does pop up, don't worry and just click on close or on X to close it down. In my case, I have to click on X. So we click on it and then a new web page should open up. Yep, there it is. So a new web page opened and we also have to scroll it down until we see that download button right here. Now I click on it, and in a couple of moments the download is going to start for you. Usually it doesn't take long. Then click on install and wait until APK time gets installed to your Firestick or Android TV device. And then afterwards, do not click on open yet, instead press on done, because this way we'll have an option to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on our device. So click on delete and then delete it once again. This way, we save ourselves some free space on the Fire Stick, and that's super important, because you don't really have too much of free space on your Fire Stick by default. Then, let's go to the settings once again. Here we are. Scroll down, go to My Fire TV, open it, go to Developer Options, once again install unknown apps. This time we have to locate APK Time and turn that option on as well. It's a must, because we'll use APK Time to download other applications from the internet. And now, finally, let's go to the list of apps on your Fire Stick, which is right here. We open it, scroll down, and here at the bottom you'll find APK Time, which we just unloaded. Now, I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote. That's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, APK Time is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore, it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Of course, don't forget to keep the VPN connected before accessing such applications. And then finally, let's open APK Time. Wait until it loads for you. And here you'll find all kinds of categories of different applications, such as new updates, top applications, animations, animation seekers, entertainment, essentials, forestic devices only, free VPNs, gaming, live TV, music applications, players, browsers, premium services, sports apps, tools, torrent only, and so on. So that's an alternative for using a Google Play Store on your Fire Stick. And a really decent alternative, honestly. So if you're wondering how to get some apps to your Fire Stick which are not available in the official Amazon App Store, now you know how to do it. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye-bye.